hey guys how you doing so real quick i'm gonna give you this video show y'all what's in my shower caddy before i gotta go um before my phone start acting up again so anyway real quick my shower caddy ten dollars from wally world and i'm gonna make this as quick as possible because i got to go and yeah so my phone was acting up again as usual so we got this expiration date on this i was like wait a minute i never knew but anyway some powder i have more in the um like y'all can tell there's nothing in this loop but i got like two more applications some powder in there um i'm a cna i put it underneath for myself i put it underneath um my breast area you know just it's like an extra layer um protection we sweat under there and i guess it prevents rashes and irritation from my bra or whatever so that's good to do i do it for my clients my clients usually have like a prescription so i said hmm why not do it for me okay so anyway this is some equate brand um baby oil okay um your thing don't got to be expensive but whatever so this was lotion i be asking you all the time y'all but see this lotion is thin that's why we need the baby oil and we got the vaseline the equate brand vaseline we need this too because mm, y'all it takes a lot it takes a lot okay all right then this shampoo is just in here because i bought it to do a client's hair one time so if i put it in my bathroom if i put it certain places my kids feel like we're supposed to share it that's another reason i have a caddy i keep it in my bedroom and i bring it to the bathroom um i use an old shower hook um that's like still in the rod and i um use that to hook it onto by the handle while i'm taking a shower just hook it up like that um so this is my toothbrush that I used to bring overnight when I would work overnight for work, the green one in the low travel case. This was my regular toothbrush, just in the house period. Um, funny about my toothbrush. So this toothbrush I got from Dollar Tree. This is going to sound like, oh my gosh, April. Yes, but this is my first ever powered toothbrush. I got it from Dollar Tree for a dollar. It's for kids. Um, I loved it. Um, I bought, they only had the Lion King and like some other kind of transformers. Ty Ty, excuse me. Yeah. Transformers. Come say hi. Hi. You didn't get the come part, but anyway. Um, my first ever, so I had to paint it with some nail polish to differentiate between me and my children. And then this, so it come with this cover, came with the cover. cover. I just switched over to this one. I got this one, Oral-B from Walmart. This was $5.00. Y'all, I thought these two brushes was like $20, which they can be like up to $200 because they come with the um, water picks and all that stuff. I ain't doing all that. Um, So this is my first one ever, $1. I got me and my kids, $5 is easy. Well, this one costs $5 itself. And I got it because it comes with, you can change the head. This one you can't. So that so this thing has sections so this is my oral care section i have this toothpaste colgate from dollar tree whitening everybody's like your oh, white teeth so white this is why um what i use then we have these picks okay from dollar tree and then i have dental floss in here and the reason i have both of them is because i had this first I actually had these because I figured they were portable. Then the floss could be portable too, but whatever. Um, these were in my overnight bag to work. I'm not doing that no more right now, so I just put everything in here, consolidated everything, put it all in the same place. So this is. I bought this from the travel section. They got it at Walmart, Target, maybe Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree, I know they got Scope. Um, I like Listerine, so this is the bigger bottle. When I'm done, when this is empty, I just refill it. With this and then my older children i'm encouraging them to have a caddy too because uh they be losing stuff and it costs money so it's better to have a place for everything so i got them these bottles and then whatever then 
just because it goes there. I got this. Um, let me turn the camera down to the caddy so y'all can see what I'm doing here. So we got um, chapstick, and then I got this little pick. Sometimes you need the real thing, so it comes with the mirror and the um, toothbrush and all that from Dollar Tree. So all this stuff, I have to put it back because if I don't put it back immediately, bad things happen. Um, so all that goes here, all the teeth stuff goes here. Um, so you guys, these, these wipes I got from Dollar Tree, I do not use them. I um, I'm putting them in the car because sometimes my eye tears, specifically my left eye, it tears at random for whatever reason. And then I'll like look up and it'll be like crust running down the side of my face. I'm looking like I ain't washed my face, and I'm like, but I did though. I have these, y'all. I bought them. I don't know. I might as well just give them to Brooklyn because they burned my. I don't like how they burned my face. So then. Here, I have an obsession. I go to the store and I just be like buying stuff. I see it. So this, I don't know if y'all can see it, it says Axe. So this is for men. Men can do it smells so, Well, it smells like Axe, smells like a man, all that other good stuff. Yes, I was using it. I used it once or twice. It's for men to wash their face and their whole body. And they, I guess even their hair. I don't know. I don't remember what the box said. But I did use it, try to wash my face with it and my body. And just because I have a problem, don't judge me. Okay, so we have this. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There. Then I cannot, well, I didn't heavily recommend it that I shave. So I bought this from Walmart. Um, like Mondays is supposed to be my self-care spa day so I apply this I'm gonna use every day type thing um this is like I don't know between eight dollars and five dollars at Walmart I'm not exactly sure I don't remember I went to Dollar Tree I bought a sensitive razor I went back looking for this razor and I cannot find it at all so I said you know what going to get near I um this is Oh, I guess I'm in the face section. So since we're talking about razors and whatnot, so let me show you guys real quick. So I bought this. Okay, this is a pencil case I bought during um, back to school. But I just like to keep things organized. I don't know. Okay, hold on. Let me grab a little. So anyway, I bought this uh, razor set from... Walmart I got the little small razor the bigger razor and then the um, guards and all that other stuff so I bought this uh yeah I don't know I wasn't I don't know I used it but mm, okay so let me be honest this is my caddy I bring it in the bathroom everything is just in here it's at my disposal immediately while I'm in the shower this thing runs on batteries. I can't leave it in. Well, yeah, I can't leave it in there and battery run out and just whatever. It ain't as convenient as I like it to be. So I got it. But mm. and then not trying to be funny, but I don't think it was intended for my course here. Okay. For being honest, I think it was intended for somebody with a little more fine here. So, um, I think I must have snagged one good time. And I was like, oh, oh no, ma'am. Mm-mm. Pineapples. So, right now I got this little Dollar Tree Lady Speed Stick. I have some, um, Dove from BJ's in my basement in a box. Like, in my little, um, my stash. I cannot use Dove. I, I can use Degree right now in the summer. And I had a Degree that lasted me for a little while. I'm gonna be honest with you, my life is so hectic that I probably never used it in the house. And I um I I keep a dial roll on in my purse at all times. So I probably was like, oh shoot, oh shoot, like here and there. 
frustrated myself because um you know i'd have to get myself and my kids ready and sometimes i'd be like um amara has this thing where she whines and it just throws me off guard so i have these they came from the dollar tree so yeah i just consolidated my things i got them in a little part here so i have marks my face so i bought this i didn't really know how to use it my mother said i'm supposed to well what i was doing was putting them like putting on my finger and patting it on the spots in my face my mother said i'm supposed to rub it on my whole face and my co-worker said oh my gosh you have beautiful skin and i'm like i said no i got these spots she said oh um you something like this i was like no because then i'm gonna go from being a chocolate chip cookie to a macadamia nut cookie i scared so i wasn't really using this but yeah i got this hopefully i saw another youtube video the other day and she was saying how she did rub it on her whole face and i'm like but only thing she said you gotta wear sunscreen with this and i gotta figure out what sunscreen i'm gonna wear because I tried it one day and the sunscreen made my face just white and I was like I need to I'm about to wipe everything off and it, it takes time this ain't just wham bam thank you man you put it on I guess you gotta let it you know absorb into your skin and then once your skin kind of like feels back to normal then you put the sunscreen over that and I'm like okay whatever. so that's like a little process and sometimes I like taking it easy so I showed you guys my two paste my uh mouthwash I showed you guys my chalmers then we have my eczema this is subject these things are subject to change so i have this i only use it once a week um this is equate brand um exfoliating scrub and then this thing i got from dollar tree Let's put it on at night, as it says. Listen, I put it on when I put it on, okay? Because this is what I like. It's cocoa butter stick. And then I bought this, maybe from Dollar Tree, maybe from the travel section at Walmart. I'm not sure. Um, the ponds. But, um... Yes, yeah, so... This scrub, like I said, what's week for that? Because my T zone, yeah, because my nose is dry as heck. My nose will literally flake. Um, here's dry, and my T zone is dry, so I gotta be like careful about over snatching stuff off my face. Um, or else I will be like, ooh, my face is just washed. Great for the day. I'm ready. And then I go outside and I look like the buck of somebody heel. So I'm like, oh no, ma'am, no pineapples. So yeah, like I said, my deodorant is subject to change. I re I use the portable, portable travel size Listerine and I refill it with the big size. I use coupons when I buy these. I have another one in the closet. I buy them with coupons for the expensive. Okay. I like to make my money stretch. So I bought this from Walmart for Amara. This is free of aluminum, parabens, and yeah. All that other good stuff. Right? So the reason I just say mine, the reason I took it to show y'all is because the other day I went to Dollar Tree. And they had this. So, you know, for a dollar. This is 2.5 ounce and this is one ounce. Dollar Tree for like, I mean, on um, Walmart for like four dollars. I think I paid for this, something like that. And then I saw this at Dollar Tree. I said, "Girl, thank you." And Amara uses this every day, but um, we've had it for a while. You know, whatever. Um, she uses it every day. Give her a bath. They use baby magic lotion. 
I bought it for myself. And I said, girl, what you buy for the baby? It's nothing. So I had to give him the um baby mag magic lotion. So I had my um body wash in here. Let me show you a second. Okay, so like there was this little dollar store in my area that had these for two dollars. Literally two dollars. This is uh okay. Listen, I'm not doing no conversions right now, but this is five hundred. Else. there's no um ounces on it but yeah it's a good size lasts for a little while um if you use a loofah me i'll be using a washcloth and then i like i have a brush came from dollar tree it's a um i have a regular brush and i have a, a stick with a loofah on it from the dollar tree so to do my back so i uh, you know but it's still let you know so I, I've been using a washcloth. You're not supposed to use a washcloth with these. You're supposed to use a loofah. Um, but I've been using a washcloth. Then um, I put some on the brush and then I put some on the loofah. So the loofah thing. Okay. Loofah. The loofah stick is not the same as it as a loofah. Loofah is that ball puff thing. It's called puff. There you go. Put your hand, but the loofah um, stick thing is not the same <laughs> as a puff. A puff you can, you know, I don't know, it's like a washcloth. The stick is hard to reach places. And then the brush, wet the brush, put a little bit on the brush. And then do your thing thing. And that's all I do. And I that's how I got my little caddy on it low. Keep it cheap. So yeah, like putting the little Listerine in the smaller bottles. So if it's multiple people in your family ain't got it. Some people drink out of the, either the cap or the bottle. You can have your own little personal thing. And then um also it helps stretch it. Um, because you can cover this back up, put it away. And just be working with your little side thing and then yeah, that's my caddy so yeah like i said on the shower hang it on a, a metal shower hook or you can go to dollar tree they got those s plant hooks get one of those hang it up there and you can wash your face in the shower you can nair in the shower you can't shave with the electrical shave on it well you probably could i don't know i can't um and then You know, wash your booty and your back in the shower for cheap two dollars two dollars um i stocked up on those so that's actually i got one in the shower now that's the last one so i gotta go buy some more for like five um because you know those things are like eight dollars a bottle right so i was like okay i can buy like five right now so then, what else? Um, yeah, wash your face, brush your teeth. The water running. A long time ago, my friend said to me, said, I brush my, she told me she brushed her teeth in the shower. She said, the water already running. So, yeah, wash your face, do everything. See, I'm a TNA, so it don't take me long to shower. Because I'm used to, like, bathing people. And I know you do, do it real quick. You know what I'm saying? Hit all the important spots, do all that. Get all the dead skin cells off. But I'm like, why are people be in the shower for an hour? Unless you and they're playing around. Um, no. I, um, I know why now. <laughs> Alright, y'all. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Bye.